Hello and welcome to Learn UX ID. Today we are going to explore some of the new options that has been given in Figma and that is searching. So uh, there are two or three different searches. I am going to elaborate all of them. We are going to see the shortcuts for them and we are going to see how we can use them and uh, live up to the Figma um, world. Okay. So uh, the first thing is that they have recently added, if you, if you have opened any page uh, inside your um, projects, you can see over here on the left, we have a small um, search icon. So this is, this is really, really handy. So this is the latest feature of Figma. So what it does is, for example, if I have like uh, hundreds of different um, frames inside a page. So um, like uh, before, it was not easy to search for a specific phrase or uh, text or maybe your frame title. For example, uh, my this frame title is interact don't tell. So if I want to find it in like 100 of different frames or artboards, I can go over here and I can search like uh, interact. And you can see it shows me uh, just uh, focused on that. So wherever the word interact has been used, it is showing me that uh, this is the frame, then we have text layers, then there are three frames with the same name, then we had text layers, few more text layers where interaction or interact has been used. Then we have this chapter three, this is again a frame. You can also filter out if you want to find a specific thing. For example, I just want to filter them just by frames. I don't want to go into the text details so I can search from here. So these are my settings. You can also replace if you want to replace some text, for example, um, let's try to replace it with um, um, I, I don't want to replace it because these are my uh, next going to be my next course on uh, onboarding user experience for onboarding. Anyhow, so this is the way you can do a lot of things. You can find different layers, their names, the text using them, you can replace it. And um, you can you, you can see over here match case whole case. So these are few replacement settings if I want to find I really love this one because uh, this is uh, one of my uh, recent designs you can see this is done for one of my clients and it has like hundred of different um, artboards for different banner designs. So it was very, very hard for me to find any of them. Um, and recently this little small search icons, it, it icon, it helped me a lot. Uh, next is uh, if you want to uh, search any component. So if you have created components, you can press shift I and you can see here we have uh, components. This is the tab. You can search all the libraries. Uh, these are the local components. And um, these, these are diagrams. Uh, this is page two. Again, the component shown inside the page I have selected. Uh, let's close this one. So this is another way of searching your local components. Uh, then we have control or command P. So here we actually can search different plugins. So let's type icon so you can see these are all the plugins you can press tab to run the last plugin uh, like this and you can also select any icon and click on it and it will be press enter to run the plugin and you can see there is the icon let's delete it so there are three different type of searches one is you are going to search your plugins uh, to dif run different commands then there are searching inside your component libraries and then we have searches inside of pages or inside your project where we can find different text layers we can replace different text uh, we can also uh, pinpoint different frames titles so if i have given a title of like uh, onboarding screens then they are uh, they are going to focus only on the on onboarding screen so i can have like 50 or 100 frames inside a page that is not going to be difficult for me to search now. 
So this is the new feature of Figma. I really, really loved it. I hope you are going to enjoy it as well. And make sure you like, subscribe and share this video and keep on uh, learning with me and we will learn together. Uh, we will meet in another video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.